What's up, y'all? It's your boy Shazne. All right, so Talabadi sixty six. So far, the energy for this film seems like an unwanted child. All right, I mean, I mean that's what the the vibe y'all been giving me. But I'm here to bring in some faith, some hope, and that is not just my own, you know, ideas and. Uh, interpretations now nah, now nah, this is based on some of these incredible cast for this film um there's been some details some rumor details about the the idea behind the film ultimately in terms of the genre we're getting a mix of many things uh, which is isn't necessarily something that I'm a fan of right because when it comes to Tamil cinema itself uh when they do these thousand genre films it never really quite works in any specific ways you know i mean it's it could be decent and fun to watch but they kind they will unfortunately limit themselves by half assing every single genre instead of going all the way to a few of them so here we getting a romance action family comedy a mix of the typical commercial genre film but the biggest difference is that it is coming from a telugu filmmaker's sensibilities so that could bring a, a unique and a creative prospect to this commercial film but i can't really have too much faith on that until i actually see some footage and the tone of the film but if this film is more of a ala vekatam puramulo kind of a vibe then that's something we kind of excited to see Talabadi in cuz if you look at Talabadi's filmography in the last decade he hasn't really quite done a film like this i mean there's some other other actors who've done it some find some hard to get through but Talabadi hasn't quite tried a family film on this level on this multi-genre aspect in a while the closest we could call maybe Bigil but even that is is a sports film with some other elements to it but here it seems like a core family drama being the main plot here and the cast is all so apparently talab is going to have a couple of brothers i mean sharat kumar is the dad i think sharat kumar is the dad i i don't know the specifics of the roles but we know sham is definitely going to be talab's brother because of the age and how they look so that's interesting i'm i'm excited to see him with talabadi of course you know he was a a junior artist you know like a side side like a background artist in uh, Kushi so it was kind of cool to really see him back with Talabadi as his brother and Sharath Kumar and Talabadi is going to be like an interesting dynamic if that's the dad and and probably was great and also we uh, it was announced that Prakash Raj is going to be part of the cast as well so after Pokri Gilli um uh, Villu um Sivagasi um you know we we back at it again and their duo and their energy is always fun. I don't know if he's playing a villain or the uh or or a good guy. I don't know that, but in terms of the actors and the cast in this film, we'll have a quite interesting dynamic with Talabadi and it's been while that Talabadi actually acted with some of these actors who's done some great work and and I think that's very exciting and and refreshing to a Talabadi film. So, keep in mind I'm I'm specifically talking about a Talabadi film. And lately most of Talabadi movies the the supporting character has been mostly fresh um aren't necessarily senior actors you know it's people that we don't really quite see that often but this cast seems like you know some of them are legends so i'm looking forward to seeing how all of that and that dynamic will come through the film and i'm quite excited i mean talabadi looks fantastic i love the look there's the, there was an image where he was in a car and i like the way he looks so they're going for a much more youthful younger version of talabadi but it is it is quite interesting with how this is shaping up to be uh, i love the constant updates uh, dilraj you know uh, i think that's the producer's name he's very excited you know he talks about the film during interviews and i also saw him say that they are planning uh for a first look release on talabadi's birthday which is next month that is wonderful so we don't have to wait that long and you know dilraj is a, is a big uh, a big producer in the telecom industry so i we all he knows what he's doing and i think the marketing for the film is going to be next low p straight fire i think it's going to satisfy uh 
a lot of the fans who were kind of displeased with the way Sun TV handled uh, Beast, uh, you know, marketing for the most part. But anyways, also a news came out that Talabadi 66 will have a Pongal release. January is going to be a Talabadi's month. The King, the Legend, the Greatest, the Yadi now. First day, first show, I'm going to be there. You know, it's, it's, it's a given. It's a given. But that's great. So we might actually getting two films. I think we're most probably going to get two films of Talabadi in 2023. So we're getting this Talabadi 66 family commercial entertainer. And then the same year, we're going to be getting something seems based on the rumor mill, something quite special with Lokesh. I assume the movie might finish uh, finish shooting by August. Talabadi takes his usual one month break, like a one month uh, vacation in between films. So September is probably going to be his one month break and then October that's when it's going to start uh, working on Talabadi 67 with uh, with Lokesh and there's some casting rumors for that film already but still ways ahead so I don't want to get you know we, I want to focus on Talabadi 66 right now and when it comes to the music of course we know uh, Taman is a massive Talabadi fan you know he's, he's mentioned many times that Talabadi is his idol and I heard that there's going to be six tracks I mean that's a lot so this is a very old school, very classic commercial beat. I mean, it's been a long time that we saw a commercial film with six tracks, but the difference here is that it's with Talabadi. So I'm I'm excited to see a lot of it's been a while. And if they if they do, if they hire the right choreographer and we get some great dance numbers, Talabadi is clearly adamant on delivering a complete family entertainer, a a break to his choices. Meaning a film that is more of his old school type. The movies that actually gain a lot of the fans that he has now. So this movie is like, just like in every, every film is going to be all on the director, right? Vamshi needs to do a good job executing this commercial entertainer because we've seen some great commercial films of Telugu cinema in terms of Telugu cinema. They are one of the masters of commercial film and Vamshi coming from that background and that sensibilities. I do have faith in him. But again, I got to see more. I think the first look will indicate the tone. And I think once the tone is set, the expectations will rise to that level. We all know it's a family film. And I think we're all kind of waiting for that to digest because we don't know what that really means. But I think with the first look and maybe with the teaser and the songs, we might get into the zone and we'll walk into wanting to experience a fun commercial film. So it all comes down to Vamshi and the way he's going to execute this film. But Talabad is pretty clear. Because I think Talabadi 67 is going to be another film that is going to try to push his boundary. You know, he tried with the first half of Master, but I think with Talabadi 67, I think he's going all the way. He's going to hand 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 over the keys to Lokesh and be like, whatever you want, let's go all the way. There's no 50-50. There's got to be a 100% Lokesh film, especially Vikram. Based on how Vikram is going to be executed, if that film lives up to the expectations that we all have, I think Talabadi 67 is going to be something people will be losing their mind, uh, their minds for. So I'm looking forward to seeing that, but that's still ways away. So I don't want to get too much into it, but Taliban 66, this is where we at. Ultimately, I am getting excited, understanding what kind of a film I'm expecting out of this and I'm up for it. And like I said, if it's more of a ala Vikitam Purmulo than a Viswasam Vannata, I'm on it because I loved watching Ala Vikatampuram. It was a fun, over the top commercial film, but they knew what they were making and they embraced that. One of the greatest skill set Telugu cinema has is that no matter how crazy some of these stories or action set pieces can be, they take it very seriously. They embrace it. And Talab 66, directing, directed by a primary Telugu filmmaker, this could turn out something really fun, a old school commercial film. But we just got to wait and see at the end of it all. We just got to have faith in Talabadi, man. Uh, what this reminds me of is that um, Adi scene. Yeah, so that's Talabadi right there. I think Talabadi is in that zone when everybody's doubting this choice. A lot of uncertainties around it. Talabadi is like, let me hit this sixer, bro. I'm coming. I'm the goat. I'm the king, the legend, the greatest. And I think Talabadi knows better. And he's been, no matter the movie he's been making, 
there's always something in there for us to appreciate. Even Beast, the first 20 minutes, the, the dance numbers, I really like this character, the action sequences, you know, Talabadi was going for it. Talabadi was always giving us 110%. Again, like I said, this movie, Talabadi is going to go all the way in. He's going to commit. But as usual, it all comes down to the filmmaker delivering it. And I do believe Vamshi will do so because he has a pretty good track record when it comes to commercial films. With that said, guys, let me know what y'all feel about Talaba 66 at this point. You know, when it was announced to with all the crew, the cast, some of the story ideas and the potential of it all, how y'all feel today? I think when it comes to this film, the more we get to see, the more you guys will kind of hone in on your actual feelings on the movie. Because right now, we're just assuming stuff. We're interpreting our own ways and we're projecting our own thoughts into this. I think the first look next month will settle and I think it will set the tone for what can we expect. With that said, thank you so much for watching. If you guys enjoyed this, like, comment, subscribe, hit the notification bell and see you guys on my next one. Salute.